how to add a progress bar in ClickFunnels 2.0. So as you can see here, in 1.0, we would be able to add a progress bar just by looking to progress. And then we would have the element called progress bar. But now in 2.0, we don't have it yet. So what we need to do instead is we need to add an HTML element. So when we go to an HTML element right here, now we are able to add anything we want by opening a code editor and paste it right here. So what I have done was I created a simple HTML code uh, and added it in the CSS master bundle that if you don't have access to, um, the link is going to be down below. If you do have access to it, please go ahead and follow the progress bar for 2.0. And now this is just pure HTML, which by the way, you don't really have or need the CSS master bundle for that at all. You can even just use, um, you know, just Google search and try to find uh, the, um, the codes to create a progress bar and adjust it at your own you know, taste. No problem at all, right? So now here, you pasted everything here. And what this is saying is basically, this is the construction of the progress bar. And here is the width that it's going to have. 75% is 75% complete. 50% is 50% complete. Here is what the text that you can change inside the progress bar from almost complete to you are almost there, step one or two, whatever you want to, right? And then this is a style. This is the CSS, the colors of the progress bar, the colors of the progress, right? So you can change everything here. I've added a text shadow into the progress it's just so it's a little bit more visible, but then you have everything else here. You have the colors of the stripes and you have the animation stripes here as well. Okay, so once you do this and save, okay, and now we're gonna go ahead and preview real quick. We're gonna see a progress bar there inside that row. So now here you have the, the stripes, the color stripes, you have the almost complete, and then you have the, you know, you have the, um, you have the background color of the of that one. So if you want to adjust it, all you need to do, let's say we want to add a blue color like that, okay? All you need to do is go ahead and now adjust the colors that you want. So the progress bar, instead of white, it can be red. And when we do this, we save. And then we're gonna go ahead and preview real quick. And we're going to see that the background color of the bar is gonna be red. So um, before you didn't see the, the white color there, but this part, the 25%, it is there, okay? So now we're gonna go back in here, here. And now we're gonna go ahead and progress. Now in progress, you have this color. So if you change to this blue instead, and we save it, and now we're gonna go ahead and preview it. Now you see that the progress bar is blue instead, okay? So you can adapt it and adjust it uh, and customize it there. If you want to change from almost complete to something else, you can do that by simply go here, almost complete to step one of two, and then you save. And now we're gonna go ahead and preview it. And boom, it's step one out of two. Okay, so you can add this anywhere you like. Uh, just make sure that you add an HTML code there. And you can also add this in pop-ups anywhere that you have the HTML code element right there, all right? So have a wonderful day. If you have more tutorials for, you know, anything related to CS to, um, to funnels, funnel building and all that stuff, check the link below.